Hello, I'm Kelsey Samuels with the Plano Star Courier. And this is what you can expect to see in our Sunday paper. So we did a full story on Starlight. It's an annual free concert that brings together all the high school bands in the West Cluster, which includes Plano Senior High, Jasper, and Shepton High School. We've got full photos and a full story. Um, you can see all that at planostar.com. We've also got a story about Plano teen Evan Hera and his latest uh, short film, Intangible. It premiered this week, Wednesday, at the Angelica Film Center. You can read more online. We've also got a story where we touch base with Hina Khan, a licensed professional counselor, who's offering tips to parents on how they can talk to their kids about race and racism, especially on the hills of Charlottesville. We've also got a story on Collin County and how it's the second healthiest county in Texas and other reasons why. So check out these stories, photos, and more at planostar.com, and I'll see you soon. Join us as we kick off the 2017 football season with a preview of our local high school football teams. Star Local Media's 2017 Gridiron Preview will be full of team photos and rosters, district previews, schedules, upcoming rivalries, and key players to watch. Check it out on newsstands beginning August 24th or follow along all season at gridirononline.com. Hey there, I'm uh, Matt Welch. I'm the sports editor with the Plano Star Courier. Just wanted to pass along a look at what's going to be in Sunday's sports section. The first week of fall football practices is in the books, and uh, myself and Tim Glaze were out and about throughout Plano ISD all throughout the week. Uh, Tim was out at Plano East and Plano West. I was out at Plano Senior, and we will have stories on all three football teams in Sunday's paper as they begin their preparations, as they continue their preparations, I should say, for the uh, for the upcoming football season. So uh, yeah, make sure you give that a read and more in Sunday's paper and as always for continued coverage of the local sports scene make sure to check out starlocalsports.com appreciate y'all watching